Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, let us join it together as we will guide you through the process of adding products to your Shopify store, an essential step for beginners. Once we have accomplished this, we will move on to creating a collection list on your homepage to showcase the diverse range of products available in your store. Our first task is to establish a collection list on the homepage to highlight the variety of products we offer. However, before we can proceed with that, it is crucial to populate your Shopify store with products. So, let's get started. To add a collection list to your homepage, navigate to the Sections Overview. Click on Add Section and select Collection List. Now, in order to populate these collections, we need to add products to your Shopify store. To begin, return to your Shopify dashboard. If you'd like to keep the editor open, by opening it in a new tab, alternatively, you can save your current progress before proceeding. Once you are back in the dashboard, access the Products tab on the top left. Here, we will commence the process of adding your products. If you are uncertain about the types of products to offer, stay tuned for our upcoming video on a Shopify dropshipping tutorial for valuable guidance. Don't forget to subscribe. For those who already have products in mind, Click on Add Your Products and provide all the necessary information for the product you wish to add. Let's demonstrate this with an example product, the cat t-shirt. Fill in the product description, upload photos, set the price, and consider specifying a compare at price if you wish to showcase a discount. Remember to input the product quantity in inventory. If you want to continue selling even when a product is out of stock, be sure to select the appropriate option. In the shipping section, you have the option to add the product's weight, especially if you intend to charge shipping fees based on weight. If your product comes in various variants, such as different colors, you can add these variants here. Specify the quantity available for each variant and save your changes. For effective search engine listing, ensure that the URL is clean and then click Save. Repeat this process for all your products. To add more products, simply click Add Product located at the top right. Once your products are successfully added, you can organize them into collections. Suppose we want to create collections like Cat T-shirt, Dog T-shirt, and Best Sellers. For this example, we will focus on creating the cat t-shirt collection. Navigate to collections in the left side menu. If you have any existing collections you no longer need, you can delete them. Otherwise, proceed to create your collection. Provide a name, description, and set it as manual. Include an image that represents the collection, and your collection setup is complete. You can create multiple collections as needed. Return to your product list and assign products to their respective collections. Select the products, click on the three dots, and choose Add to Collections. Then, select the appropriate collection and save your changes. Keep in mind that the products can belong to multiple collections if necessary. Lastly, return to the editor and assign the collections you have created to your collection list. Customize the text as desired and save your changes. Congratulations! You have now successfully added a collection list to your homepage and populated your Shopify store with products organized into collections. When customers click on these collections, they will be directed to their respective collection pages, allowing them to explore and purchase your products. In our next video, we will discuss important topics such as website content, store policies, navigation menu, theme settings, and adding more pages. Stay tuned and subscribe to our channel to stay updated. We hope this video has been helpful. Thank you for watching and see you in our next video.